How's it going? It's going good. Good, good. How much is the controller? Two dollars, man. Oh. Don't have any other video game stuff, do you? Nah, I don't. Nah. How much on the food? So anything that's packaged is two dollars. And then like the new toys are gonna be a dollar. I got I got a, a Game Boy Advance with three games. Oh, no yeah. charger. Well, the Game Boy Advance they take batteries. No, I don't. I got a charger. No, not a Game Boy Advance. Yeah. A Game Boy Advance, the little square one that flips up. That oh, that's stops. the SP. Oh yeah, that's what I got. Yeah, you want to sell it? Yep, you want to buy it. It works though. It works. Okay. I saw it come on, and the, it got this here. One. Okay. And it got it got another game. I'm what did you offering. What no. did you want for uh -uh. it? You sell and we sell, <laughs> and you know exactly what it's worth. We got another game. Okay. Hey. Bye buy and we sell, but oh, I saw, yeah. yeah, my friend at the free market he buy, yeah. but you asked about it. Um. Games. If you had like a Pokemon game or something, it'd no, be a I lot just got more. That Mario Three is yeah. worth something. Whatever is fair to you, I ain't yeah. gonna listen. It'd be like forty bucks for you it. You got a deal. Here you go. I got comic books, but you don't buy them. Not really, no. I have no more video games. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Yeah. Selling the trailer. I don't have the key to the lock. I let you oh, okay. it with me. How much are you selling that for? I like to get about two grand for that. Yeah, it's a nice one. It is a nice one. It's got every it's got all this shit in here already. You know, scrap. Probably could use some new wood. It looks oh, yeah. bad, but it's in pretty good shape. It's nice. All this other stuff. Yeah, I don't have the key to the, the lock on the ball, unfortunately. Next weekend we'll get that. Okay. Next weekend we'll get that one. I'll bring all the keys next time. Good morning. Good morning. Is that a GoPro you're wearing? Yeah, I have a YouTube channel that I do a little bit on, okay. buying and selling and all that kind of thing. Yeah. Oh, put us up. Tell people to come. We got more jeans here than Macy's. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Did find a couple of old rods in here. Couple of those. Yeah, older pins. Old pins. Oh, yeah. What do you want for these? I don't know. I haven't even looked at these. They've been sitting around for a long time. Until they're kind of dusty. Yeah. But they they turn. This is. Better than a lot of yeah. people might find. Cleaned up the rods are probably. The rods itself are. Did you get any of the tool stuff or? Not yet, really. Um. Well, come on, now. I do have. Do you know what you wanted for those reels or not? No, I don't know what they're worth. Yeah. I mean, one of the thing, one of the things is you, you look up stuff, and for example, um, yeah. there's a there's a pasta maker out there, and some lady goes, "Well, I can get that." I told her I wanted twenty bucks for it. She goes, "Oh, I can get those uh, Amazon for twenty five bucks." Well, I looked on uh, there, 
they got them for 17 for some piece of crap and the end, and ones like that are like 75 bucks a piece yeah. so i wouldn't she People didn't say that, yeah. argue with her it was just one of those things so yeah here's just the real right here penn senator i mean this one's in pretty good shape 56 bucks just the real what, long what size is that that's the 113 i think that one was the 114 maybe it said 114 h i think it's this one i think it's that one that's the one it is right there yeah the 114 h so that one went for 70 bucks just the real the real alone so i got a, i got some some fishing friends down in palm beach county where i mm -hmm. live and really that's the saltwater reel yeah so they i don't know if they might want it i don't know i'll see i got your card and right. you know we'll stay in contact about stuff i can tell you that what about the are there any of the tool boxes you're going to sell any of that kind of stuff yeah, in there sure eventually yeah because i got i mean he was a tool collector as you can see yeah. um I, well, I need to reduce it down just to one set because there's, you know, he would go and say, hey, it's a nice socket set. I, I got to have three of them, you, you yeah. know, and then two of them. And there's a lot of stuff in here, Frankie, that's, that's never been used. It's still uh, in the case and stuff like this. So what about any of your, your weights? So any of your weights? Those are my sons and I don't okay. know what he wants to do with them. So I don't want to yeah, get rid of this stuff. Or... Get rid of this stuff. This is a... A little bit old. Pretty cool. This, I, I did see this the other day. I know that there's a lot of reproductions out there. Yeah. This is 1920. I don't know if this is 1920 or not. It's pretty freaking beat up. Yeah. I'm not sure. They are tough. This one isn't like porcelain or nothing, but. No, it's not a porcelain. Yeah. Would you sell it? Sure, I sell that. What's this one? What do you want for this one? Well, I don't know if it's truly old. I mean, it looks old. It looks really old. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't yeah. know. Her daughter uh, works in Atlanta. She's the brand manager for for Coke. Oh yeah. I mean, you know, is it worth 20 bucks or worth five bucks? You, you well, I'd give you 20 bucks for it if you wanted. I mean, it's worth that okay. just for you. Okay. What, okay. what kind, is it like, is it like all craftsman stuff you're going to sell? Or is there any like snap on or Mac or anything like that? Or do you know? Um, it's really a mixed bag. Mixed. It's really a mixed bag. And you wouldn't want to sell it all just to one person? Like if I bought it all? Um, I wouldn't mind doing that. Uh, Until ultimately. you go through it. I want to get right. myself a set. And uh, I probably will keep one of them, you know, just a bottom yeah, one and the top, them. and then sell everything else. Yeah, I'll uh, like I said, I'll I, I, it's, I just got to get at it. Yeah, you yeah. Know, there's so much. It's a stuff. lot of a lot of work. So you'll see down here the grating. Mm -hmm. It's a perfect, and the U stands means it's never it's never uh, circulated, never. Uh, so this has never been owned by anybody. It's unpunched, never been on a rack. This one graded too. That one's graded also. That you will not find. <laughs> yeah, I just want to see uh, yeah. what the highest the, one actually sold for. Probably not much on the individual character, but with that one, since it's never been, there's only one of a kind on that one. So you could just scan that and find the item? If they put it in a certain way, like 
So when you list something on eBay, if you put that number in, then all of them will pop up. Mm -hmm. The people that don't put it in, when they sell it, they won't. It's just... The one, the one goes for a lot. What's the, um... I remember seeing a guy that did a thing um, on YouTube. He's got like a Joe outfit on, the Ninja Turtle one. I can't remember his name. Oh. But the one of this, it goes for... Yeah, I mean, that one right there, like I said, it's one of a kind. Uh, it was has never been circulated, and it was bought, found in a KB Toys box uh, back in the day, sent straight to for grading, and the lot that was in it, they graded them. So there's that one and whatever one. Here's one that sold in 2014, which is almost 10 years ago, and it was graded at 85, and went for 500. Yeah, but that one there's 5K. 10 years ago, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, that one there is 5K. This is 6K, and this one was 2K. That's what they were? That, yes. That's what I paid for them, straight out, is what I paid for them. I have the receipts and everything for them also. Hulu. You wouldn't even think toys hold value like that. Oh, God. These are never been opened, never been out of the boxes. 1980s, early. I wasn't even born when these toys came out. <laughs> <laughs> but as you can see, I have a huge collection, so I've been doing this. Um, they come to me a lot of times for how much should this be sold? How much is this? You want to take a look? Yeah. You got what you got, like a storefront? No, this is my office. Oh, that's your, oh, yeah. wow. So it's, yeah, it's just a quick little video. So it just goes around. It's, then I have several out being graded still. You got a channel? Uh, not yet. I just you moved to the area and we're remodeling our house that we just bought. And it's taking much more than we expected. Some people so are I'm, this though. Yeah, so I'm uh, having to take these in so we can finish the renovations this month. And then I get uh, when I get paid at the end of the month, I'll come back in and pick them out. Whew. But yeah, we're almost done. I'm covered in paint. How much did you say this one was? This one was two. Yeah, in 2016 it sold, the only one I could find that sold went for a thousand, but that was, like I said, yeah. 18, this one was two, years, seven years ago. this one, what I paid, was five, two, and five. And then right now this one is being sold, like you saw, for six yeah. on eBay right now, so. So one sold in 2022 in March of that one not even graded and it's it's just i mean it's in good shape but it's what's going on everybody so as you can see the guy came in with these three pieces i had the camera up fortunately the camera died it's it's a little hard man when you're in here and somebody comes in and you're trying to get this camera set up but i try but anyways this is the three pieces he brought in um this Casey Jones right here, he was telling me this is the highest grade of any of them out. He was saying that that one's never been in circuit, or what he was saying was about it was basically it had never been owned. It came straight out of a box from KB Toys and straight to get graded. I mean, that is the highest grade. I can't even find one that high of a grade. You can find some in less and they're around like $500, but none has sold in a long time. So he said he paid five grand for it. I'm not, he should show me a receipt. Um, I don't know if I could get that for it, but I figure it's a minimum of thousand, two thousand dollars from what I've just seen online. Maybe even more. I'm just not a super expert on toys and grades, stuff like that, but I know they are desirable. And, and if that is the only grade in that high, then you probably, it probably is that much. I'm not sure. Um, the other piece I've seen, I did see a bunch of these that sold, even not graded. New in the box, not open. They're like seven fifty to a thousand, so I'm sure graded like this. This one's at least like two grand, and I think that's about what he said he paid for it, something like that. This was a desirable piece too. I see the van of just this one, out of the box van only going for four to five hundred. I couldn't find any that were similar to this, but I'm guessing this one's a few thousand too. Um, earlier in the video, 
you see me go to a garage sale. So that was Friday. On Thursday I was riding and I, they got, I found a yard sale that I stopped at and I ended up buying this at a yard sale and that's why I talked to the guy about it in, while I was at that sale when I bought the coke sign. But anyways, this wasn't even for sale, it was just leaned up against the fence and it is double sided and you can see where it was in the dirt leaned up against the fence. And um, I guess the guy's dad passed away and had been a collector and I asked him did he want to sell it and he said yeah he would sell it, give him 200 bucks. So I ended up giving him $200 for that. And at the time, I didn't know, you know, how expensive it was or whatever. I just know it's a porcelain sign, and I know I wouldn't be losing at $200. So I gave him the $200, and on Worth Point, I found one that sold in 2016, I think it was. It went for $2,000. So I guess this is a pretty desirable sign. And the last one was this sign right here. Um, he had told me he might have some tools for sale, so he took me in the garage to look and see what else he had, and I seen this sign. And I asked him what he wanted for it, and he told me $20, or $25 or $20, I'm not sure right now, but I think it was $20 or $25. But um, I didn't know if it truly was that old. It looked that old, but, you know, they do fake these, like these right here, all these signs up here on the wall. These are reproduction signs and I mean they do make them to look old so I was pretty sure that one was real but I'm not sure and once again I didn't look it up or nothing he told me give me give him twenty dollars for it and I see ones in a little better condition going for around like five hundred bucks but I thought these were super cool man I grew up in the 90s I was a huge Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles fan but once again, we got the giveaway coming up at 2,000 subscribers. I'm trying to get more consistent on putting videos out. We've just been so busy, went on vacation twice. So appreciate y'all watching. And once again, subscribe, hit that like button, notification bell. And we got a giveaway in the coin video we just did. So make sure you're watching the videos because you never know when I'm going to throw something out there for the people that watch and support the channel. Thanks.